Connecting Arizona, live from the 12 News Studios at 200 East Van Buren. This is 12 News Today. It's not even Thanksgiving, but already you need to start worrying about a holiday toy shortage. We will explain. It is not even Thanksgiving yet, and yes, it is already time to think about your Christmas shopping. In fact, retail analysts say you should worry this year. Our Jacqueline Schultz here to explain the toy shortage. Jacqueline, this is not good for the parents out there like me. Yeah, that's the last thing you and other parents want to hear, especially 15 days before Black Friday. But it's this layaway trend here at Toys R Us and at other stores nationwide that's causing supplies, especially on certain toys, to go very fast. Ah, tis the season for some serious stress. As if last-minute holiday shopping isn't bad enough. Oh, I think we're going to see out of stocks this summer. Stop the sleighs. Not enough toys for Santa this year? Ho, ho, ho. Oh, no. Sounds more like the nightmare before Christmas, but this is the reality. Retail analysts are reporting that we could see a toy shortage this year, even a shortage of the average present. You're a mean one. No, the Grinch didn't Mr. steal Grinch. the presents. Notice all those layaway ads this year? Retail analysts say that shopping strategy may have worked too well. It definitely works. Definitely spurs sales and spurs sales early. It's become easier to lay away presents at stores like Toys R Us, Sears, and Kmart since it's now free. Plus, add the fact that national stores are cutting inventory as a trend. Analysts worry you'll run into barren shelves before Christmas. You should buy now. Even jump on that layaway bandwagon. Shop online or use one of those shopping apps to make sure your presents are in your local stores. And save yourself a crazy shopping run and give you your best shot at shopping success this year. And what's also making the situation a little worse is that some manufacturers are not distributing that much uh, stock to toys this year. In fact, some have stopped making certain units of some toys. Joining me right now is Lisa with Toys R Us. Okay, some of these toys here, manufacturers have already stopped making for the year, and these are already toys that are hot in the layaway list. Yeah, they are hot, hot, hot. I you know we have been layawaying probably since the end of September. So come into the stores and get it now. We have our free layaway program, no upfront fees. And and you can shop and just have it right there ready for your kids. All has to be picked up by December 16th, so plenty of time. So right here we have the Tabio. That's going pretty fast. So is the Furby on the hot toy list this year. And what else do we have for boys and girls? Well, we've got the Light Bricks, which is really cool. Kids can um, construct an airport in this box here, and they're, they're LED lit. So they can just close in the dark. and put, puts a little bit of a spin on the construction toys. And then Monster High, again, is so popular for the little girls to come in and there's a whole wide variety of Monster High dolls again this year. Oh yeah, All right, my photographer Mike Brannick, his daughter definitely wants some of these. Faye, anything on the hot toys list this year that your kids want? Oh, I'm or sure they're looking for. I'm sure there's a lot, but hey, Jacqueline, let me ask you, why did they stop making hot toys? You know, uh, retail analysts didn't tell me why, but the big thing is they don't want a lot of excess inventory this year. Uh, they don't want half-priced items. So what you're going to see the day after Christmas, actually, is that you're not going to see a lot of these in stock or a lot of these half off. So that's what a lot of manufacturers and a lot of toy stores want to eliminate this year. We need to get those elves cracking. That's what I say. All right. <laughs> thanks, Jacqueline. Appreciate it.